Hello everyone, I am Shyam Pasari and welcome to ASEN Academy. As you have seen from the title of this video that we will be learning about circles in this topic, we will discuss all the basic points about the circle that is the center of the circle, the radius of the circle, the diameter of the circle, what is the chord of a circle, the circumference, perimeter and the area of the circle and at the end we will also discuss some interesting points about the circle. So without wasting any further time, let's begin with our topic. So our first question is what is a circle? Now circle is basically a plane figure which is bounded by all its sides. The shape over here that we have is a circle. Now you can see that circle is bounded by all its sides. As I've said earlier that a circle has infinite sides. So I can say that a circle is a polygon of infinite sides. The center of the circle is a point that lies inside the circle and it is equidistant from all the points lying on the boundary of the circle. So this point over here is the center of the circle because it is equidistant from all the points that lie on the circle. The distance between the center of the circle and the point lying on the boundary of the circle is called as the radius of the circle and it is generally denoted by the letter R. A straight line passing through the center of the circle that connects two different points on the boundaries of the circle is called as the diameter of the circle. If I name the points as A and B then AB will be the diameter of the circle. If I denote AB as D, then I can say that D is equal to twice of R because you can clearly see that if this distance is R and this distance is also R, then the diameter of the circle will be equal to 2R where R is the radius of the circle. The straight line that connects two different points lying on the boundary of the circle is called as the chord of the circle. If I draw another straight line joining these two different points, then this line will also be called as a chord of the circle. So a circle may have as many as infinite number of chords and the only restriction is that it should be a straight line and it should join two different points lying on the boundary of the circle. The chord passing through the center of the circle is the largest chord of the circle and it is called as the diameter of the circle. So the diameter of the circle is also the largest chord of the circle. If you take a point A on the circle and you start moving from this point and take a complete round around the circle and again come back to this point, then the total distance that you have traveled is called as the circumference of the circle. The value of the circumference of a circle is equal to 2 pi r where r is the radius of the circle and pi has the value of 3.14 or 22 by 7. The value of the perimeter of the circle is also equal to that of the circumference of the circle. Thus the value of the perimeter of a circle is also equal to 2 pi r. The value of the area of a circle is equal to pi r square where pi is equal to 3.14 and r is the radius of the circle. There is one interesting and important fact about a circle that is 
for a given area the circle has the smallest perimeter so for all the shapes possible with a given area a the circle has the smallest perimeter another interesting fact about the circle is that the circle is the most symmetrical shape among all this is because all the diameters of a circle divides the circle into two equal halves and a circle has infinite diameters so a circle has infinite lines of symmetry that is why the circle is the most symmetrical shape that was all for this video and i hope that you understood all the topics covered in this video and if you have any doubt then you can post your doubts down in the comment section or you can send your doubts to us to our channel's official instagram or facebook page and we will surely solve your doubt as soon as possible i have also provided the link to the official website of asian academy down in the description so you can check that out too and if you did like the video then please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel asian academy Oh, oh, oh.